see I'm not listening to Alexa, Spotify or anything I'm just listening to Cal singing all day long right so let me show you what we got here so I managed to do the ceiling so far and I'm using the coat paint um, color sweat band sweaty pants <laughs> So we're getting um, Victorian quite a big co-wings. Um, the rose ceiling has just arrived as well. So what we're gonna be doing is hiding all the um, ugly bits of areas, the ceiling and the walls adjoining together. Yeah. Um, the, oh my God, honestly, this paint is so easy to work with. I'm not sweaty because of the paint. Oh, sweaty bits. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Um, so I'm not sweaty because of the paint, honestly. It's just painting ceilings is so hard because just a constantly pushing up and you have to push as well. So, yeah. <sighs> but what was good palm workout. I'm happy I can carry on with the rest of it. But, so, review. Yeah. Very good coverage. So this is only one coat. And I'm not gonna lie, I think on the ceiling I don't even need more coating because it's covered every single bit that you need to cover. Um, on the side vault, um, the one that you just newly plastered, these sides, beautiful coverage. Again, I don't think I have to go through them. But these old walls, these ones that we just patched up here and there, definitely need another coverage um, because obviously the, I PVA there. Um, you don't really need to PVA it, just I wanted to make sure it sticks on it. Um, so I did that, which I haven't actually showed you guys, but yeah. So from there to there, I'm definitely gonna go on one more coping on the side, but on other ones, very, very happy with it. And it's so creamy textures. Um, how much I have left in the bucket? So this room is four meter times uh, 1.5. 1.5, that's the whole way. So from that, you can calculate um, the ceiling. Um, so basically, that's the coverage, plus a little bit left. So from the ceiling to that first bit of, let me just show you. To the third bit of lying, this one, is 30 centimeter from the top ceiling. So if you calculate all that, um, I'm using a 2.5 liter of a bucket and this is all I got left. So this is all I got left. So I did manage to go through quite a lot. Um, but the best thing is, like I said, you do not need a second coat, literally. Um, if you're using it, this for a newly plastered wall, absolutely amazing. If you're using it on an old wall like this, patched up only and not fully plastered, I would definitely re recommend two coating. But newly plastered, completely good with one coating only. Absolutely beautiful and really, really easy to work with. I love how creamy is the texture of it. So. And I love this paint scene. it's not like that cheap quality paint, it's, it's a very good high quality paint, so I'm very very happy with the colour, so let's go. Hi everyone, oh for Jesus, I just woke up, right, so hi everyone, um, I got these little details from Aliexpress, um, and what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna update this fireplace, which I'm not being really happy with at all since day one. Um, the paint I used on it, it's um, very bad, I'm not gonna lie. It's a chalk paint um, and it's not the usually company that I use, Ani Sloan. Um, it's another company that I'm not gonna mention, but I'm really not happy with the color at all um, and the texture of it. So I'm gonna repaint it and I'm actually not gonna use chalk paint this time. I'm going to use a coat uh, paint called Sunday Soul. So we can try this out as well. And um, just to let you know, this is a collaboration with Code. So I will be updating this fireplace um, with this thing. <laughs>
one, absolutely perfect and beautiful. I can't believe that fireplace is actually free. I got ordered these little details from AliExpress, I think they were like 30p. Um, then we got the Dimplex fireplace from Amazon. We got the deluxe background. Um, we got the coat um, Sunday Soul right there. So yeah, really, really happy with it so far. So I'm gonna apply the second coat as soon as it's dried and we are done with this.